I'm David Verrill, the Executive Director of the Initiative on the Digital Economy. So pleased to have you here. This is a, a multi-year activity for us, the Platform Strategies Summit. Uh, and each year we have uh, a, a, a set of stellar organizers and they're lining up here. Uh, stage left, uh, Jeffrey Parker, Peter Evans, Sangeet Chowdhury, and in absentia, Marshall Van Alstyne. So thank them for the content uh, of today's event. So I'm going to talk very briefly about uh, the IDE, which is your host for today's event. Uh, and um, much of the IDE is uh, um, has started because of a, a very interesting book that the guy right there wrote, uh, Andy McAfee, with Eric Brynjolfsson, uh, called The Second Machine Age. And the basic thesis is that technology is increasing ever faster in, in its pace, but our organizational structures are falling behind. The IDE has as its mission to make sure that we, we allow those uh, organizational structures, those business models to catch up with the pace of technology. So in doing that, we've put together um, a series of activities. Research is a primary one. And as you can see on, uh, on the screen, there are four primary areas of research. Productivity, employment, and inequality is one. New digital business models is a second. Social analytics and digital experimentation, a third. And last but not least, uh, big data and information privacy. We have a series of principal investigators in each of those areas is doing a lot of work with uh, a couple of dozen students and postdocs. We also have a number of meetings like this during the year. Some are large, some are small, some have a particular theme. Uh, some are like our Jeffersonian dinners, uh, put everybody to task to make a change upon leaving the dinner. Uh, and you're welcome to participate in these if you're interested. Uh, let me know or Christy Coe. Where's Christy Coe right there in the back? Christy manages our corporate uh, uh, relationships, so I'm sure you'll see her throughout the day. Uh, we also have a, a, a fellowship program where we host visitors, and uh, we're, we're not the type of people who sit in our offices and think deeply about the, the digital economy. Uh, it's a, a, a large uh, grand challenge of our time. In order to solve these issues, we need to have a lot of people pitching in, and so we have a fellowship program where we entertain people for a day, a week, a month, a semester, a year, uh, and they become part of the fabric. They're an emissary upon their, their completion of their work, uh, and they bring their own perspective to us. Um, we uh, also have some educational programs. Within the, the graduate program, we run an analytics laboratory, and I know many of you here in the audience have pitched projects for that. It's a student teams working on a project in the fall. That's the entirety of their course. Uh, some really interesting uh, results from that. It's all focused on data and analytics. Uh, and we uh, are running a series of exec ed programs, and the platforms exec ed program is our first. It's uh, the first iteration was a couple of weeks ago, and we'll do another one, and hopefully you'll, uh, you'll participate in, in that. Uh, and last but not least, we have a really interesting inclusive innovation competition. It's a million dollar prize, which will award um, uh, cash prizes in four categories. Uh, and uh, we've just completed the initial registration round. We had three times as many uh, registrations as we had anticipated, so we've struck a chord, and, and the basic notion is that we need to start celebrating and helping those organizations that are helping everybody in the, the employment and work pyramid, not just uh, the, the privileged few at the top. Uh, we couldn't do uh, any of this without the generous support of our sponsors, and in particular, I'd like to point out Accenture as our primary sponsor, and I'd like to welcome TDF Ventures, one of our newest uh, supporters. We also have the benefit of very strong relationships with some of the leading foundations who are helping to, to push our, our results into the public policy domain, which is an important aspect of, of meeting this grand challenge. And obviously, we have some very generous donors. Uh, some of them are alums of MIT. Some are just really interested in what we're doing. And we appreciate all of their support. Um, our conference agenda is chocker block. We we're starting a little bit early, and we're ending late. So this is going to be a true drink from the fire hose today. Uh, turn your phones to stun. Uh, you're, you have open access to the MIT guest uh, wireless system, but shut it off. Um, pay attention to what's going on today. Get involved. Ask questions. Uh, and uh, let's see if we can end the today uh, with everybody going away with the notion that, wow, we really uh, I, I found something new and interesting, and I'm going to try to implement it where I go.
So this event also has uh, some generous supporters, uh, TDF Ventures, Bearing Point, and Accenture, and as well as your host, the IDE. Uh, and if you don't have this book, uh, we've brought a couple hundred here with us today, so you're gonna walk away with a signed copy. So I uh, hope that you'll uh, enjoy that, that read, it's a great book. Uh, and please tweet, we have a, a, a Twitter monitor over there off to the side, so if you wanna see your name up in fame and social media, it'll be there, uh, and this is our, our hashtag. Uh, I'm David Verrill, the Executive Director. Christy Coe is our Associate Director. We're here to help you. If you've got any questions or interests, uh, let me know. Uh, so, I will let uh, Andy McAfee kick off um, the program with his welcome and introduction of our, our keynote speakers. So, Andy, take it away, please.